Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to tackle problems on mechanical vibrations in Mechanics of Machines 2. The piston of the steam engine moves with simple harmonic motion. The crank rotates at 120 rpm with a stroke of 2 meters. Find the velocity and acceleration of the piston when it is at a distance of 0.75 meters from the center. Solution Finding velocity of the piston when it is at a distance of 0.75 meters from the center. Velocity v is given by angular distance omega multiplied by the square root of radius or squared minus distance x squared. As you can see we have some unknown variables. Finding unknown variables. Angular acceleration omega is equal to 2 pi n divided by 60 which gives us 4 pi radians per second. Note that we divided by 60 to convert RPM to RPs that is revolutions per second. Radius R is half the stroke length thus equal to 1 meter. And X is given as 0.75 meters. Thus velocity V is equal to 8.31 meters per second. Finding acceleration of the piston when it is at a distance of 0.75 meters from the center. Acceleration is equal to square of omega multiplied by X. Thus acceleration is equal to 118.44 meters per second squared. Now let's tackle another problem. A helical spring of negligible mass and which is found to extend 0.25 millimeters under a mass of 1.5 kilograms is made to support a mass of 60 kilograms. The spring and mass system is displaced vertically through 12.5 millimeters and released. Determine the frequency of natural vibration of the system. Find also the velocity of the mass when it is 5 mm below its rest position. Solution Determining the frequency of natural vibration of the system. Frequency is given by inverse of 2 pi multiplied by square root of g over delta. Where g is gravity and delta is extension. Finding unknown variables. Gravity is equal to 9.81 meters per second squared. Extension delta will be found by equating the following. Thus extension is found to be 0.01 meters. Therefore frequency is 4.98 hertz. Finding the velocity of the mass when it is 5 millimeters below its rest position. Velocity v is given by angular velocity omega multiplied by square root of radius or squared minus distance x squared. Finding unknown variables. Angular acceleration omega is given by the square root of gravity divided by extension. This gives us 31.32 radians per second. Thus velocity is equal to 0.359 meters per second. Don't forget to subscribe, like and comment. I am Engineer Mayday, when you need help Mayday is the call. You have been an interactive learner. Thank you.